super uh, giant snake monster that can kill you with its venom. They're like, let's catch it, put it in the palace, and test our skills. And it's just like, how bored are you? And the, the answer is <laughs> I yes. Do, I do want to show you this, guys, but I don't think we have time for it because it's 50 minutes. Oh, God. Oh, my goodness. It's all about being a DM, but I'm sure I can show you at least a good portion. You won't understand most of what's going on, but you'll see as it goes. You first might like things it. first, we need a game master. They're playing they Warhammer are Fantasy. Are building the adventure. Oh, you you building both will Magnus. understand this. <laughs> Magnus? Oh. Is it because I said build? Yes. <laughs> you find yourselves in the castle of Castle, which <laughs> looks over the town of Town. <laughs> Wait a month until the taxes of the peasantry are tallied so you can begin renovation. <laughs> the harvest uh, is also uh. coming soon. Rogel, we are trying to not be senselessly bored. Nothing is more enjoyable than the overseeing of development and the distribution of resources to the infrastructure of an I urban environment. Game running privileges revoked. Who <laughs> else <laughs> wishes to master the game? But yeah, you'll learn more about these characters as we go on. I know. Fable has already been spoiled on stuff, so I'm not gonna. Found the game. I could give it a go. Oh, here we go. This on the condition that you keep your horned dog or swag away from us. <laughs> <laughs> You're ready. You all arrive at the slabnasium of the quivering isles. The air is thick with monsters. <laughs> 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 Lord Magnus, if I may, you're the only ones who have thoroughly read that rules tome. Yeah, this is why fa this is why Karst is Magnus. Statement? I have to. The rule book is much like a law book, but for nerds. I wasn't aware you could read through that ridiculous tome. You got something against people who can't read, dog hack? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, hat jokes, great fun. Thanks, Wrinklemongers. <laughs> okay. Okay. Before this descends Warp into the senior citizen slaying, I hereby take command of our role-playing crusade. Today we shall be playing Fantasy Battle Roleplay Second Edition. It's uh, it's Warhammer Fantasy Second Edition. Uh -huh. Strange and fantastical yet familiar. I will say, Cars, if you want to get to something a little less grimdark, look up Warhammer Fantasy. It's a lot less grimdark. Hey, wait. Uh, okay. Okay. Like, quite literally, in Warhammer 40k, there's not ways to combat chaos, really. But in Warhammer Fantasy, there is. Or to combat chaos corruption. That and the king slash god emperor actually did what the emperor couldn't. Yeah, the... Uh, basically, he has them roll up their characters. Finally! Okay. Feel the characters you've rolled up, please. Let's get ready. I am the Celestial Shaman Queen. <laughs> she does not have a name, for she does not need one. She is a powerful wizard, and shall be the supreme sovereign of this kingdom before the week is out. Can't be a shaman, or a queen. <laughs> Apprentice wizard is what you are. The fact that you have a magic statistic of three should be enough to make your ego quiver like one of your bodyguards. Fuck you. <laughs> I am Sir Lovely Marcelo, Knight Errant of Noble Britannia. This is what I basically played as, as uh, when I was playing Warhammer Fantasy. The Knights of Britannia are basically, they're outside the Empire of Man, but they actually do have their own goddess, the Lady of the Lake. And uh, basically, they are magic inclined. They're most. They're basically Arthurian legend mixed with being French. I have come to the Empire on a quest to drive evil from the lands of Sigma, that I might return in glory to my lord, that I might become a knight of the realm. They're quite literally powered. The the <laughs> Norsken Reaver. I have come from the cold lands to take from you Southlings your coin, your men, your world. <laughs> but I mean right now, I'm just here for missionary work. Let's go. Rod Loverson, apprentice runesmith. His life goal is to become the owner of his very own Smithy Inn hybrid. Rod Lagerson is also a squat, but in not space. That's a dwarf dog. A squat. Squat. Oh, there is no they need to come up with silly comedy names for them, Magnus. It's a joke on how Warhammer 40k does that with, like, because instead of elves, we have the Eldar. Yeah. 
And yeah, instead of space elves. and instead of dwarves, we have squats. Don't be preposterous. Pyramids, apparently. Welcome, Nougat, Imperial litigant. I am here to uphold the law. <laughs> well, I'm Bulgo Potato Skin, Halfling Field Warden. I have come from that there moot place to visit some. Oh, yeah, the halflings. Family. According to this here character sheet, I got like 600 siblings. Benny Backstab, <laughs> a rogue, a lone wolf with a dark heart and dark <laughs> passions. As you can see, they're filling out the whole roster of the usual uh, stereotypes for every s different type of role uh, RPG role-playing player. Uh, Mac, yeah. aren't the halflings in, in Warhammer called, like, 40k called ratlings or something yes, like that? Yes, in 40k they're called ratlings. Yeah, I hate Warhammer sometimes. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, we have the dude who doesn't know what he's doing, so he just made a random guy. There's going to be a guy who gets too far into it. The edgy guy. And the guy who just wants to kill stuff. Alright, that's great. Thank you. So I have this other tome here. It's called The Tome of the Parallel. It writes itself as you play. It generates as a result of you taking actions with your characters. As if the tome was simply reporting on events taking place in a different universe where your actions have actual, tangible results. But yeah... Uh, Karst and Fable here are both DMs, so they will understand Magnus's pain in a way I could never. ...towards a consistency with the plot and what you have said to prevent any sort of flubbing of the rules, roles, or roleplay, but it will also allow a significant degree of control over all ah. that happens. So remember, mm -hmm. I am your god. So if I stop believing in you, you will stop forcing us to play baby games and go away? <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Let us begin. But yeah, like I said, Karst and... F ah, fuck, stupid. Karst and Fable will fully understand what I mean. Will fully understand Magnus's pain as a new DM dealing with a bunch of new players. You find yourself in the city of Altdorf, the capital city of the greatest nation in the old world, the Empire Also, I think Karst is dead. Three things Karst, the are you dead? Great. Faith, I am dead. steel, and gunpowder. You only have right, one of these things and not a whole lot of them. <laughs> the world needs great Get heroes some for the time being. There are great heroes in Warhammer Fantasy. What we'll have to do. But first, you're going to have to make a name for yourselves in the city in order to realize your potential. Though he is now venerated as a god, Sigmar was once a mortal man like you. That is true. The god of the Empire of Man is Sigmar, who quite literally went on a killing spree and united all humans under him for a bit. Or not all humans, you but you know. Striving for the same height. Tired. It's fine. Did you hear what he first rolled for? No. To see if there's any dog in this. Those are die trying. I rolled to see if there's any dog in the streets. No. <laughs> the DM just says no. Oh my god. Ew. Oh god, why is he digging into poop? Because he's a dung collector. <laughs> like oh I said, god. they they went the full he's... array of characters. We got the edgy first time player, the troll player, the guy who doesn't know what to make, so he just makes a guy. Emperor Carl the Francis power gamer, which I assume is a freaking emperor. Yeah. yeah. Ew, oh, girl, oh. <laughs> oh, disgusting. And a knight of Bretonia, who just wants to be. Hordes of teeming rats. Perhaps this matter is why he is called the evil player. Yeah. <laughs> all right, you lot. I, Lord Magna Buckethead. I've gathered you all uh. here today in order to collect the favors what you lot owe me. <laughs> Since you're all those adventurer types, I guess you could say I'm here to give you a quest. I told him to fuck off. Fuck off! 
I would like to see him try. I roll to destroy his soul. Judge too harshly. I do the same thing with all the shit. Why do you defy me? <laughs> I am a noble knight, and a noble knight. And the guy who gets into the role play. The tongue is a flexible muscle. So it is. Oh my God. Jesus, oh, guys. Oh uh, yeah. Jeremy was rage. The Imperial Zoo. <laughs> Humongous fire breathing dragon and feel like a five year old getting his one last wish fulfilled as he wastes away at the hand of the Neglish rot. If oh, you God. Do, I'll give you a big bag of guns and shiners. Alright. My one wish is to destroy! Yeah, alright. <laughs> yeah, what could go wrong? My immersion broke. What? Why? Why would we be guarding this man when he can get actual guards to guard him? Aren't we supposed to be paying back favors we owe him? Why aren't we helping him take back his horrible town in the... Bordello Princess? Oh, the blue is in the tongue, though. Please shut <laughs> your mouths. I didn't he gets way into one direction. And this is of no matter. He just wants gods and you happen to be available. We didn't pick them, you naughty red ball pen. We rolled them like you said we should. Shut it, you screaming canister. <laughs> That's why you should call cars nowadays. You naughty red ball pin. <laughs> My immersion too has been broken. Why would a zoo of vicious monstrosities exist within the confines of a city where technology has not even passed the earliest periods of the Age of Terror? It's an early modern city, Dawn. They're not fucking cavemen like Britannians are. We smart white people do not. I do not think cavemen have a concept of knighthood. Moving <laughs> on. <laughs> The funny thing is, is, is the funny thing. Where well, you mean the DM? Like, like I said, I, you and Fable would f fully understand what Magnus is going through as the, as a DM. Yeah, but I mean, I feel attacked because I literally have a a zoo filled with monstrosities and other animals. I'm kind of glad the players haven't called me out on that yet. <laughs> Cause we like Fable. Yeah. I'm so happy you do. Oh look, it's the Imperial <laughs> Dragon. <laughs> yeah. I'm gonna see if I can pet it. Does he have a popcorn? Yes, he has popcorn. Yes, he has popcorn. Yeah, he wants to pet the Imperial Dragon. This is the best that day I ever had. Seems like an that unwise thing. Here and I could throw him to this beauty. <laughs> die a happy man. I'm so dragon's dog. For perception. Who succeeded? I went and did a thing. Did no one else succeed? I did. No, you didn't. Fuck you. Alright. <laughs> 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 oh, yeah, you looked around you and spotted anthropomorphic shadows. Oh, the rat man. Oh no! Yep, the Skaven are here! Oh no! Which was used to summon the horned rat into the world, causing hordes of rat men to team from their under empire and assault the surface world! Everyone, it's what every rat broke out the second to burger head! I'm going to tackle the rat with my superior strength so it flies into the dragon's cake and dies immediately. <laughs> you can't do that! We haven't even rolled initiative! I rolled to kill your initiative. <laughs> okay, listen. I will allow you to roll to grapple it. Roll weapon skill with a plus 10 bonus because of charge. I roll. 
Let's see, does it go? Oh. <laughs> Escape and dodges and you charge right into Magna Blue. Either the dice are bugged or our collective perception of reality is failing us. Okay, one of going to dodge. Rolling agility. <laughs> Fuck. Oh, oh, dear. With Magna Bucket Head. Roll damage. <laughs> Not be damaged. According to the character sheet, you rolled maximum weight for a human woman. This matters. Of course I did. It complements her strength of 40 and toughness of 40. She is a perfectly carved avatar of all mankind. A slab of fibrous perfection that could end any of her wizardly contemporaries into a reicland black pretzel. I'm going to look at and see if you fudged your rights. Regardless, you have still slammed into him, and by basic physics, I yeah. declare you rolled damage from the impact. Don't worry, though, it's just unarmed damage, since I'm feeling nice. Fine. Rolling d10 for damage. Yeah. Oh! You rolled oh, a 10. Boy. Fuck it. <laughs> okay, roll your weapon skill again to confirm Ulrich's fury. Ulrich's what? Ulrich's fury. That can potentially be the result of a critical hit in this game. Basically, in Ulrich's fury is basically if you roll a 10, you get to roll again. And if you roll a 10, you get to roll... It goes on. When you roll maximum damage, you get to re-roll your weapon skill with the same modifiers to see if it activates. If you do, you'll do a whole lot more damage! That's some gross shit. No! It's entirely legal and that's entirely correct! Thank you, young man. <laughs> I'll roll the dice, father. I'm sure it'll be fine. Ten damage shouldn't even be able to hurt Magnar on its own. <laughs> Two degrees of success. Uh, roll a d10 if you would. Th crit. <laughs> oh, <my leg>. Ow. <laughs> oh, great. That's great. Great job, Shaman Queen. You're a great big giant and a great addition to your team. Way to go. He's still screaming. I wish to check around the general area. Sure, perception check. <laughs> I succeed! What do I see? You see a pile of old bones, a cannon, the zoo pillory, a barrel of lamp oil, a hot dog stand. I run over and grab the oil barrel! A hot dog stand. I wish to throw the barrel at the Skaven! Bretonian knights disdain ranged weaponry. They do. This is not a ranged weapon trip, it is a barrel of oil. Okay. Throw a ballistic skill. Major success! Three degrees of them! <laughs> he also got oil on Magna. <laughs> uh, <laughs> critical hit! The Skaven's uh. cranium is destroyed. Suddenly, so the lower you this roll, the higher the success, but the higher you roll, the worse you succeed. That's yeah, the high. it's a D100. If you roll a uh, 1, then you'll get like oh, a lot of degrees. It's basically a super crit. Oh, that's just great. <laughs> He's still screaming on the ground. Great plan. Now we're all covered in oil. Good job. Oh, wait. Just kidding. I'm speaking fluent sarcasm if you couldn't tell. Hmm. Hey, now, Mr. Back Attack. That isn't very nice of you. Stop trying to befriend me. I won't do friends <laughs> <laughs> I'm in huh? Yeah. Okay, so Magnar's leg is still broken. <laughs> what do you do? Uh, um, I roll the fuck shit at Magnar. Karst. Karst, you want to Oh, I'm, I'm muted. Oh, Sorry. that's where you. But yeah, yeah how... Karst, you want to know something funny about the Skaven? The Rat sure. Man. Okay, so the Rat Man can basically be described in terms of army is cannon fodder and cannon. There is no in between. You're either a cannon fodder or you are the cannon that's also going to become the cannon fodder in a few. Yeah, months. they have like World War One esque weaponry, but the problem is they can never truly take over the world, even though they have the most numbers, because they're all too busy fighting amongst each other. Yeah, they don't believe in the Geneva Convention, and either in the Skaven <laughs> universe, like you're either have the weapons or you're a slave that's going to become a weapon. Yeah. It's so stupid. <laughs> it's so uh, funny at even, the same time. Even their own god doesn't like them. Yeah, he hates them. 
and they hate him, <laughs> but they have to, but they backstab each other because that's just how it is for them. But yeah. Hey. And yeah. What do you think of the game so far, Karst? Uh... I... No comments. <laughs> oh, he threw poop at him while he's screaming! I oh, wish to fortify the bars mean. of the dragon's cage, so the dragon doesn't break through the dent made by the bucket head. That really is not... Okay, fine. I am fortifying this iron cage. <laughs> Wait, that's terrible. Why did I say that? Just throw a smith skill test. Help me. Oh my god, stupid ads. Is it fair to say I can see Rogel Don being friends with the uh, League of Voltan? Yeah, I can see it. You can see it. <laughs> 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 uh, Ongak material. Uh, Ongak is like a slang term for dwarves saying that's poor material made by humans because, you know, they're master craftsmen. <laughs> Toughness, 25 wounds, and he was your only contact that I thought to come up with for all of this, and I spent at least a week writing his backstory. And now he's dead. Congratulations. <laughs> so any relatable feelings there, Cars Fable? I have been lucky enough that my players have not done anything this <laughs> stupid to the point where they literally let an NPC die. However, I've been in games where NPCs have died due to stupidity. So yes, this is relatable. First blood! <laughs> Why didn't you just give him a fake point to burn if you wanted him to live? You can tell that with my main characters? Oh, this yeah. part. Didn't you read the rules? Fuck you! <laughs> he pisses him off. <laughs> he pisses him off because he knows more about the game That's than the GM. And after hearing all the commotion, they see the Emperor's cousin twice removed, chopped to ash, some remnants of his arm. Listen, there are so many obscure rules in these books. It's hard to figure them all out. <laughs> oh, you're saying so you've done the same? <laughs> no, but listen, I, I made a watch this YouTube short. But this person's talking about some really obscure book like rules in the DMG. Like apparently there's literally one where you can keep slashing enemies until you until you run out of enemies. It's so cool, but I don't read the DMG. It's so long and hard. Stop right there, criminal scum. <laughs> uh, on, my <laughs> I charge the first card! Roll up and skill. Now roll the first shell of the second card! No! <laughs> no. He shoots at you while on the run. And wow, you succeeded. Ravioli, ravioli. I do a dodge skill test. You can't do that. Why the ass not? <laughs> specify that you cannot dodge or parry ranged attacks. That makes no fucking sense. Yes, and those arrows are too fast to dodge. No, they fucking aren't. <laughs> I have dodged millions of arrows in my day. But you're a giant skeleton god. The arrows probably burn up before they eat. <laughs> He's crushing his head now. <laughs> and I will fire my arrows and put your pieces to the test. Hey, shut up! The arrow misses, but the god escapes. <laughs> She's ready to kill him. What a at your soul! That's uh, against the law. Burn the city to the ground. <laughs> so, sorry, what, what are we doing now? I just, I've been kind of spacing out. It's real hard trying to keep up with all this. You are now wanted by the. I've had players who do that. Uh, I hate it. <laughs> <laughs> where they just space out over all the lore you've given. To the east. Yeah. East is they just where to our lives. They're like in combat or talking mm -hmm. to each other for five seconds. <laughs> and the player comes back saying, "Oh, I was spacing out like." There's not much going on! Why are you ceasing now? Feed us now. There is where the key to godhood lies. No, what? What the fuck? Yes, sounds good. We head for the eastern border. Agreed. Oh, certainly. Yeah, that sounds like a good old time. The law is more yeah. tenuous eastwards. They all agree to go in a random direction. Uh, purple hours later! You hungry, little guy? <laughs> 
You understand that feeling? Yes. I rolled to charm him so as to convince him <laughs> to let us hide in his hearts. Alright, roll charm skill test. Let's roll. My <laughs> child, you look like dung and I hate you. Please let us hide in your cart, for we are fugitives! <laughs> your rules are consistently amazing. This is why chaos must die. Oh, is yeah. that what you said? I crush him with my axe! <laughs> Cutting out. Oh my goodness gracious. <laughs> Corruption points are a thing you can actually get. It involves chaos from what I remember. I'm assuming the more corruption points you get, the more closer to chaos you become. Or chaos, you know, corrupted by chaos. Oh yeah, the chaos dwarves. Ah, uh, this is just great. Amazing. You've all truly done a bang-up job with this. We're leaving a trail of corpses behind us, and you lot are driving us straight through a mountain range with a horrifying name. You are incompetent. You are failures of the highest degree. I wouldn't even bet on you making your way out of an ankle-deep hole without breaking your fucking necks. You should go back to the zoo and have the dragon light you on fucking fire too, you thought marred fucking sacks and fake fucking bunglers. Okay, him. calm down. Yes, yes, why are you so angry? Oh, no, I'm not angry. I just role play. It doesn't really feel like role play. Oh. Can you tell he's just getting out his anger through oh, the role play? Yeah, yeah, I can tell, but. <laughs> I'm dealing with the other high lord. <laughs> <laughs> there are some players that you know, bet through their characters. You kill that halfling. I don't trust him. He looks suspect to me. Can't trust a halfling further than you can throw them. <laughs> and we should throw this one down a ravi. What? <laughs> Oil barrel. Why would you do that? <laughs> don't take it personally. I'm just role playing. <sighs> Why I never <laughs> even know what role playing is anymore. Okay, everyone, do a perception check. Perception. Success. Success. I succeed. I have succeeded. Despite the oil in my eyes, I prevail. I succeed. No, you don't. Stop lying. Fuck you. Stop looking at that fucking book. <laughs> 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 oh, <laughs> ogres. Quiet, boy. Yeah, fiddle skunks. It's where I am. They're toll collectors. You have just run into the native population of the land beyond the mountains of Moor. An ogre. They had ten feet of reckless hunger and rage with the strength of two draft horses and the stomach capacity of at least half my father's ego. <laughs> he has decided that you are his next meal. Oh, so Damn, that's a man with stomach. Fight break, sir. Yeah, they their whole thing is they worship the great Ma and constantly need to eat. Poligo broke oh, many an urban hag player, surprised and are automatically at the bottom of the initiative list. Roll initiative list. Our first Benny McBackstab, then Urban Hag Flare. Urban <laughs> <Hag -flare. laughs> sounds like a name Rancroy would make up. I begin to charge really? <laughs> yeah, he loves hags. He not. keeps trying to kill him in my game. Well, <laughs> for valid reasons, though, but still. Brands the power yeah. of me. <laughs> you miss. You have too much lamp oil in your eyes. <laughs> Yeah, they eat everything. The and honestly, if they don't get enough food, the ogres might start eating each other. Yeah! Murder, murder, kill, murder, murder. I will defend this position. I am part of this position. <laughs> you are thus legally obligated to defend me. 
<laughs> oh yeah, the noblins. Yeah, they are uh, basically think of they're like goblins, but for ogres. The best way is. Hell, there's one model where the the over gracious Galrog, the over tyrant or leader of the ogres, literally just has a bunch of noblins carrying him. And he is a big boy. Uh, probably, mo probably around thirty. <laughs> you could never pull that off. Success! Oh god! What the fuck? This is such a cool game. <laughs> Alright, you nub ticklers. Here's a taste of some moonland justice. Oh my god. <laughs> Killed them all. Well, that's a surprise. Your enterprising thinking has laid the noblars low. Yeah, the noblars. You still got the ogre left, though. I mispronounce their names. That's not bad, Adam. You can't kill legs. <laughs> oh, God. 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 Oh, Oh, of course. <laughs> I like the uh, the gore. You think to shoot me, coward? You have no honor. This disrespect to the code of generous combat shall be your downfall. I shall close the distance between us before you can even shoot me that thing. <laughs> He mm. can't do that, it's illegal! Yeah, you're too many yards away from the ogre to pull off a charge. <sighs> but you have missed one crucial detail, gay pastor. I wish to charge with the aid of the slick trail of oil created by my fallen comrade. <laughs> okay. Roll to turn Let's to see if this works. of minus 30. Oh, he could never pull that off. <sighs> I put my faith in the liver of the dice. The liver of the dice. I've just oh, you got a ninety-six. Pages of no one cares. From a book called. Yes, I know, Bay. I watch your stuff regularly. No. No, you have to do this. Have failed the lady. He has failed the it's lady, which is their god. Father, it's your turn. Magnus, one of the spells I can cast is Magic Dart. The spell Magic Dart is said to hit with considerable force. Is the force considerable enough to launch the knight forward? <laughs> <laughs> If you get a critical success, I will allow it. My master! Are you going to- Easy peasy. Reality obeys me, for I am its emperor. One critical success coming up. Yes! Go, my emperor! Go, 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 go! Magic art, away. <laughs> critical fail. It fails Nietzsche's curse. A catastrophic <laughs> magical mishap occurs, and I get to decide what happens. <laughs> oh boy! Oh hell no! Well, if it's force you want, then it's force you will get. There you go. Oh. Ah! <laughs> <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> 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 Christ! 
Yeah. Oh, damn. Hey, how is it? What's his space backstage doing? <laughs> yeah. Oh, no. Dead. He dead. He dead. He's dead. <laughs> yeah, he's dead. Oh, no. Well, that's that. That's my day. Good game, everyone. <laughs> We'll just continue on our way. No! We must avenge the fallen! <laughs> These creatures have claimed a soul loyal to our cause! We must claim a thousand of theirs in return! <laughs> I actually have a story that's kind of related to this. <laughs> in what such way? No! So, uh, basically, you know how Magnus said if you can roll a crit success, I'll allow it? Yeah. Uh, so basically, in my first, uh, my first campaign, Curse will probably remember this, I had the players fight a undead T-Rex that was literally, uh, spouting out zombies. Mm -hmm. oh, the yes. barbarian, the barbarian grabbed one of the zombies and said, can I throw it back at, like, can I throw it back at the, uh, T-Rex? And I'm like, oh, sure, yeah, the roll is high, <laughs> yeah, the roll is high enough. Webby actually grabbed the zombie, rolled a high enough roll. I, I don't think it was a crit, but it was really high. Mm -hmm. rolled, a, rolled a really high roll, and I described as she gently, like as a halfling, picked what? up a... Yeah, Webby's a barbarian halfling, by the way. So Webby picked up a uh, zombie, spun it around, and threw it back into the mouth of the T-Rex it came from. Oh my God. I was like, I was like, I'm so proud of you, but at the same time, why are you we like this? <laughs> <laughs> Webby was insane. Webby was an insane character. I miss her so much. But yeah, I they're following him off the road now. <laughs> You're all taken hostage immediately. My power wanes. <laughs> it's against the law. Out ye come, lovelies. You're gonna be looked over by the Gorgia Lord himself. The Gorgia Lord? What kind of sickness brings an ogre to call his tyrant Lord? Ha! You be beat. The Gorgia Lord's not your standard ogre. He is the hugest, yet stringy, with body all swollen except for the gut. He hopped. Hopped from the dark, from the great jaw. From the mall. The old tyrant with a like the old tyrant is the one I described, Grecius Gowrel. Or I couldn't he probably sing his name wrong. Yes, he got hungers. He is simply power. And you might just get a taste of before you throw down the jaw. Way to hype up the boss. I didn't. This is all the terms writing. <laughs> also, Fable, do you need to go soon, or should I? No, no. Okay. I, uh, I got a call. They're not coming till like eight. Oh, okay. So you I got, got them. Some unfashionable drags lost in my mountains. She's here. God damn it! Yes, I know you want wandering waves. I don't care. I'm still hey, not Chris, playing your gotcha. Have you played that game yet? No, I Just haven't. Out of curiosity. All right. I, I got enough. Like I got. Game. I got enough games already. No. Oh. Did yeah, you come that running into my camp? We wish to destroy you, uproot your culture, and burn this land to ash! <laughs> that works problematic. Alright, I'll give you one chance to redeem yourself. If you don't succeed, I'll just go ahead and throw you down into the great jaw right here. Yeah, the great so, jaw. Does any one of you happen to be a powerful wizard? <laughs> I am a powerful wizard! <laughs> You say, create a portal to another universe. Of course I can. Okay, <laughs> no. No, you cannot. Not possible. You only know petty magic. You're an apprentice. Creating a portal to another universe isn't even possible to do within the confines of the game's magic rules. I roll uh. magic. <laughs> I cast marsh lights. <laughs> Oh, you see what he's doing? 
Yeah. I will them to hold is now a portal. <laughs> the hole is now a portal. It will take you wherever you wish to go. My, my, my. Looks like we're a host of lucky boys. Pack your things, everyone. Or actually, don't. Where we're going, we won't be needing lead belchers. Come on! After me! <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, that's evil. <laughs> Victory! <laughs> <laughs> Never call me that again. <laughs> you are also very lucky that ogres are somehow more vacuous than green skins. <laughs> Unacceptable! Whatever universe they enter shall burn! I shall be its new god! <laughs> oh no! <laughs> okay, so we've been half players. He went too far into the roleplay. <laughs> <laughs> we now lose the place or something. I've done that I before. I've nice. got so tired, I don't know what to tell the players. <laughs> um, yeah. Yeah. Ew. Mm -hmm. uh -oh. He's returned. Oh, no. <laughs> <laughs> oh God! The torch, our lord, is not. Did you, Critten? You insipid bastards! You peerless babies! And now the final fight begins! Roll initiative! Okay, Gorge Your Lords goes first. No, Alright, here we go! <laughs> Father, your skull is crushed and you are dead. I use a fate point. Wow, you're the first one to actually do that. Yeah, you get you're like two fate points at the start. Part of your uh, I played only like one or two games of Warhammer Fantasy, but I had to use one because someone decided to aim a blunderbuss in the same area as me because I was fighting, I think it was a ghoul or a demon. Dull, though. Oh my god. I had to Absolutely. use it to dodge because you I didn't want to die. I don't matter, I suppose. I'll just destroy you, the rest of your kingdoms, and then find another way back to my spice man. Hey, this would <laughs> spice way power. Spice man. <laughs> no, you can't. That is unfair. Hey, you can't just set us up with an opponent we can't even defeat. Magnus is a bad GM. You ain't even supposed to be here in the first place. You were supposed Post to protect Magna Buckethead! I mean, we tried to with that, but they just up and died because of the rules. <laughs> yes. uh. Not able to die? That would be cheating, and I am not going to cheat! Nothing about this situation is illegal! You're the one that started him! If you didn't want him to die, you shouldn't have given him any stats! Rules as written! If it has no statistics, it cannot die! <laughs> 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 Can rub the game right. Magnus is a bad GM. Shut it! Okay. Here's mm -hmm. the thing. You should run away. Well, that's the option. Yes. Run away. Go back west, and I'll set you up with a brand new adventure. Mm -hmm. A fair one in the moot. It'll be fun. You'll have a clean slate. You won't be killed by the guard. You won't be eaten by an ogre, and most importantly, you can finally experience a story, mm. themes, and characters. You'll be making a brand new mythos in a way. You'll be the centerpiece of a story, weavers of a tapestry of dreams and jubilation. Just run away, take Father Pseudocorpse <laughs> with you, Pseudo and go back. No! <laughs> You are dishonorable, Magnus! I will not run to this land of empty promises like a coward! This may be a trap ride into hell, but it was forged of our own decisions. We made this adventure our own through the pitfalls and the mistakes and the critical failures and the destruction of a fabulous nightly bottom! <laughs> it is 
ours. And the fact that it is ours, the fact that we have made this, that makes it worth fighting for. Now, what do you think of that? I... I don't this, know. It's so dumb. But you gotta agree, the fact that they made something together, doesn't that make it worth fighting for? I, I mean, I'm always happy the players are having fun, but they're insane. <laughs> it's an ended tragedy, that's for sure. We'll see. I will stay to spite you and your railroading ways! Oh, he said the yeah. word. Yes. Fuck you, Magno! You ruined my clown goblin illegality law! New game goal. Spite Magnus. New game, spite <laughs> the GM. <Okay. laughs> if you want to fucking die, then you shall fucking die! <laughs> oh dear. Where we go? Swing a rock at him! Can't defeat him with rocks, you absurd little man! Sir Dwarf, may I borrow that Ashton tongue? The um he can have his um gag weapon. Okay, so mm. like, I think the gorgeous lord or whatever <laughs> kind of passed me, so uh, yeah. I, I, I do a look around at stuff roll. <laughs> 20. God damn it! We're having a moment. Well, Can't you ads care. ever stop <laughs> with your little bullshit? I don't care. You find the useless trash that's behind by the ogres. Oh, what's this? Time to reverse advance. My law book is of no use fighting this creature. I'm off the front seat of the gorgeous law. Stop that! It's not funny. What <laughs> 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 the fuck is this? <laughs> oh no! Oh no! Oh, you are a death row now, shit brute. The gods are Lord charges! Damn! <laughs> he got all this shit on him, too. No, Promethean breath is going to miss this all completely. Yeah. Yeah, nothing of value is lost. <laughs> we will. So, this was a lead belcher, right? Like, this is obviously a gun. How, how do I fire it? Bitch, you can't! It needs fire to fire, and you don't have any! Oh, I suppose I'll just have to start throwing dung. No! <laughs> I have reversed advance to the other side of the kit. I do a perception roll. I succeeded. What do I see? A bunch of scrap, weaponry too big for you to use, weaponry too small to be effective, a bonfire, a hot dog. Spread <laughs> to the bonfire! <laughs> I am sorry, my friend, but the law already burns in this land. I walk over to where father is. Uh, I will help you, Grunty <laughs> Wizard. Bless you, Shaman Queen, you awful! <laughs> Take me closer to them! Why? I have an idea! <laughs> What's wrong with her arm? I her leg? She's been like that because up. of that critical fail, remember, with the bolt? A oh, hot dog right. stand again? Yeah. Force your feeble She's skull essentially later. cursed by uh, oh, chaos oh, gun. I see yeah. what you're doing now, lit again! I love wild magic. You fuck my shoes! Yeah, that's what Zeke is. Wild magic at its finest. Yeah. You have to go through us first, beast! The Gorger Lord smashes through your body, knight! I uh -oh. don't! Succeed! No! Brothers, once I shall reunite with Sue, once I've annihilated you, we will never get meet whatever mind spawns you called brothers! I want to charge! Yes! I roll to dodge! Please fail. <laughs> no! <laughs> you wanted him to fail? Yeah, I wanted the bad guy to fail, you yeah. Mm -hmm. You think your puny heart and weapons can pierce my skin? 
think again, boys. So what's up? Right. A one. Four. Critical success. Is that a rock? He's dazed by a rock. <laughs> hey, here's your chance, little man. Yes, I take my chance and I run past Gordon. <laughs> Father, are we close enough now? How many yards away are we? Three. We are within its reach. If those two die, we will more than likely be next. Good. Stay here. We must wait for the right moment. Yeah, man, this is angry. Yes, he is. Yeah. Oh, oh shit. the halfling! The little man. No, yeah. Oh, no. The little That's man. That's bad. That's really bad. He was our lucky boy. Hey, he I was our lucky boy. No. Yeah. Every every you team has one. Had your cranium caved in by a punch the force of a frag grenade. You are dead. Well, that doesn't seem very fair, you big red jerk. Bye. <laughs> <laughs> I needed but one more successful rock throw. <laughs> yeah. It ain't going well for him. It really is this. He's wearing his hat. Oh, so He's pissed. This again. My muscles are stronger bones than any pathetic alloy. He's not angry for losing his friend. Uh-oh. He rolled a ten. He rolled a ten. <laughs> That's not enough to hurt him. His toughness rating is way, way, way too high. Look here. That axe gives a pathetic plus three on damage. With the roll, you only get 10 extra damage. The Gorger Lord, meanwhile, has a toughness rating of 70. That 13 points of damage you do are completely nullified by his toughness, meaning you cannot kill it. Objection! Mm. No, Magnus, you're forgetting one crucial detail. He rolled a 10. No. That means he gets to roll again for extra damage. Okay, fine. As if that will make a difference. Let's see. Go ahead, waste more of my time. You're going to die no matter the result. There he goes. Come on, get a ten. Ulrich's Fury. Ooh, oh. Another ten! This means Ulrich's Fury is activated! Oh god. Yeah, here we go. Feel the power of the lady. Oh my god! Oh my god, I just keep building! Oh my god! It's building with power. What is this? Oh my god! <laughs> Even the DM can't believe it. God damn it. Oh, god damn it. <laughs> well, you saw when he rolled at the very least. A nine? Yeah. Oh, we're curious as all. Uh oh! Yeah.
He's so unbelievably pissed. Are you bald though? Thank you Sleep spell. <laughs> what? He's using the sleep spell. Oh my God. A power test, you great red piece of turkey. <laughs> your petty magic can't do anything. I am your god, and oh, you will uh, die. <laughs> <laughs> Twenty-five! Twenty-five! I succeed! No. Oh, no. I feel like- I feel like Magnus has some issues. Oh, you think? <laughs> yeah. Magnus, your character's willpower is ten. <laughs> eh? Hey? You know what that means. <laughs> Karis, there's a reason that the lore why everyone says Magnus did everything wrong. <laughs> oh. No, he's asleep. Hole, hurry! No, he's asleep and on fire. <laughs> and also missing an arm. Bleeding out. Correct. He's not dead yet, my friends. Come, let us return him to the pit where he belongs. Oh god. <laughs> Jeez. Just throws him in there. <laughs> <laughs> I see now that the law is not everything. Sometimes the law must burn for the sake of our lives. This is in character, by the way. The law is still important to me because <laughs> I, I am the broken flesh. I am sealing this hole. Never again shall this monstrosity return to the mortal realm. After this, we should all use this scrap to build a castle. Mm -hmm. We should call it Castle. Excuse me! <laughs> I will need a medical dog. attention! <laughs> medical attention. Actually pretty fun. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah. Hey, Magnus. We won. You can't <laughs> win in an RPG. It's a lie. Just like that you is a lie. Can't win at life. Speak for you. Which <laughs> yeah. is also a lie. We won that one. We are victorious. They beat yeah, the gym. That was really neat. How we won and stopped. Even whilst our game master constantly tried to have us murdered, we won. Not even a god can stop our mighty. Ah, he's, a, he's, he's less a god and more, uh, more like oh, no. a chicken! Chicken! Oh, no. <laughs> oh. Chicken! Because he looks like a bird! Or Magnus! Chicken noises. Okay, no! That's it! Your characters are all deleted! <laughs> oh my god! Because that was a mystical tome that he just destroyed. Oh. Greetings. Oh, shit. Welcome to hell. Oh shit. <laughs> <laughs> oh shit. <laughs> but yeah. 
Uh, how did you okay. how did you guys like that? That was good. But I'm gonna have to Yeah, I you this was gonna this was gonna be the end of it. I just wanted to show you guys a few of those to get you an oh, idea and then cute. show you that one specific one. Because I knew I feel like you two would be the ones to appreciate the most. I love that. That was freaking hilarious. Yeah. Yeah. Alright. I'll All right. catch you guys later. Alright, see ya. Later, and I need though. to read someone, but first I have to check Bye. who's on. Bye. Uh, oh, my computer's acting weird. Wonderful. It's one of those days. Okay. Someone's playing D&D. &D. Someone's doing that. Uh, you know what? We'll read the new title.